What is going on YouTube? It's your boy here once more and I'm on video number four. I had to change out the batteries on the GoPro, uh, the small camera, and we're continuing on the journey. We're at Amadehi Trail System and we're doing the easy to moderate loop. Uh, like I said, it's supposed to take 1.5 hours or whatever, but I have to film everything and edit everything and so it takes me longer but I'm trying to get as much coverage as I can like I said on the on the little camera I got on my head I'm trying to get the coverage too and I did run out of battery just in time so I had to change that out so I'm gonna have two feeds and uh, it's pretty good though guys and the trail I went a little piece or a little bit or a little, to uh, keep going but I did what I had to do and got a splash of water, so I'm good to go. And so whatever, however long it takes to do this trail, I'm set. Okay, guys? So it's no problem. And I got the everything good. And I've notified a few people where I'm at. and But I doubt they'd be able to get up to me. But it's all right. Uh... At least they know a brief description of where I'm at. So it's always good to notify people when you're out hiking alone, guys. And, uh, you know, like all in my videos, I, I try to stress that uh, you have to always be aware of your surroundings. And, uh, you know, take the precautions you need. And at least check out the maps once in a while. And I did bring a bunch of stuff for that today like the compass and everything if I do get next and turn around but this trail system it seems is not too bad okay guys not too bad at all and uh, so if you want to take uh, smaller children or whatever it is it's not too bad I don't think they'll have any problems with it uh, and just pack a lot of uh, snacks I guess for energy <laughs> anyways but yeah i had to adjust everything to get it better and the batteries set up but i'm feeling tip top shape guys I'm ready to do about 20 miles and it's no problem but it's nice okay guys and i'll show you the canopy once more there you go and we're just making our way around, okay? There's no problem. But this is like my second wind, and we're on, like I said, video number four right now. So I'm trying to help myself out with editing, because once I get up there, it's hard to decipher all the pictures and stuff, okay? Yeah. But I'm doing my best, guys. There's another squirrel right in the background. I don't know if you can see him. He's zipping around. He's in the tree there. I don't know if I can zoom in on him or what, but without making him him, him mad, I'm trying not to. <laughs> Anyways. But I didn't check the coverage to see what I got on the on my top camera. But I will when I have the computer in. I can check out everything. But it's okay, guys. Everything's good. And I'm just checking everything out. All right. And like I said, like, uh, you know, I don't, I try not to get people in the shots, but there were people back there and I didn't want to get them in the shot. So I had to move up a little bit and readjust my stuff. So that's why, you know, I wasn't at the exact pine cone that I was before. Okay, guys. But it's okay. And like I said, we're still on the, the red diamond trail, which is supposedly the easy to moderate trail. I mean, it's a long one so far, but not too bad, okay? That's because I film everything. 
okay and we hit another trail marker there you go it's still the red diamond that's what you got to follow and it's no problem but it's basically just one trail really it's veered off a couple times but no you know not not anything like we're used to okay because uh I only seen that those two trails at the beginning and that was it so I guess the other one was a, a more difficult trail but this one is not too bad so all right and there's a little incline but not too bad and like I said everyone's out enjoying themselves it's a beautiful day it's nice and I'm doing my best to entertain you guys all right so yeah and trail ahead of me guys and if you can see it the glare is it gets on the camera and I can't see anything so but I'm trying I'm trying to I know I speed it up a little bit because I'm trying to walk faster to just a little bit you know not too bad but we're still taking it all in okay I guess after that water it pepped me up a little bit okay and we're still making our way and I'm just panning off so you guys can see what I'm doing and we got the birds still my buddies And we're coming to a different trail marker. So, I don't know, guys. All right. All right. What do we got here? Okay. If you look on this one, oh, I'm trying to get up to it so you can see. You can see it's a little different. We've got the arrow, the biking, the hiking, and a little castle. I don't know what the castle means. Victory? I don't know. I don't know. But, uh, we got that so this is like a four-way uh, they've got on the other side they've got an arrow going up all right so uh, let me look at the tree again all right so the arrow going up that's probably the trail we're on right now okay and it's just depicting the biking and the hiking and I don't know if that was like uh, the start of the trailhead or what I don't know what the castle means but home maybe home is your castle probably um, but yeah it goes up it goes down to the lake and it goes up around so I don't know guys um, there's a sign over here and we're gonna check it out all right uh, it says camping so I guess that goes to the camping area up that way and uh, it's splitting off in different sections here okay guys so I don't know <laughs> Ooh, what to do what to do okay it goes like I said that way it goes that way it goes that way and it goes back the way we came guys all right hmm I'm looking at the signs all right and looking at the red sign uh, the red diamond okay okay you look at this arrow here okay it's got the red uh, the red arrow on it too okay so I'm gonna go by the red arrow since the red arrow goes that way if you look you now before we had plain diamonds that were red okay now it's got an arrow depicting that's the way back because of the black right and this one's got the same you know icon or whatever on it the black arrow okay and this sign is saying that this camping is up that way okay you get it so you have to figure out where you want to go all right I guess that upper trail would be the difficult trail that we haven't been on so we're gonna stay on this trail so I believe we're gonna hit this and follow this trail if anything, when we come, if we have to backtrack, we look for that camping sign, and we're at the four-way, okay? 
So that's how you, you have to figure stuff out like that ahead of time. You know, because like if it gets dark or something and you get turned around, you're going to want to know those, those things, okay? But yeah, and a little, <laughs> spend a little time <laughs> talking about that, but I'm thinking this is wrapping around and hopefully it is. If not, we've got quite a journey coming back, okay? That's no problem. That's no problem at all, okay? We're just going to do this and yeah, okay. <sighs> and now this time the lake is on this side, okay? So I imagine this whole area that's the hillside is like, just pretend it's a big island and the water is around it, right? You're, you're going by the, the lay of the land and you want to, that's how you find your trails. And this is coming on this side, whereas when we were coming back, the, it was on that side, okay? So that's how I'm trying to figure out where to take, okay? I mean, it could throw me off for a loop, but I don't know yet, okay? We shall see. I'm trying to think and hike at the same time. And see, on this side, the birds are really rampant. <laughs> but uh, the lake is more lax than, you know, calm. So, And we're closer to the lake than we were on the other side. So, But, you know... It's a pretty nice one, okay, and it's the trail behind me and the trail in front of me, okay, guys? So, yeah, just remember, when it four ways, I just follow the arrow if I have to go back. It's really simple, but it only takes a couple minutes to figure it out. All right. Yeah, I don't know what coverage my, my top camera got, but I'm trying. Alright. I guess we've made the good choice because now the diamonds are blank again and they're red. So I guess we're continuing on the right trail. Because, remember, the icon was on the tree. But now if you look, we're back on track, and the trail doesn't have the icon. So that means we're on the same trail. You get it, guys? You get it? And it's on the back side of the tree, too. Okay. And I don't know if I tackled it before, but uh, there you go. There's a dead tree for the video right here. Okay? Yeah. And it's really peaceful. I wish I brought my swimming trunks, but I wouldn't put that on YouTube. <laughs> no, that would be like a, uh, no, I don't know. But it's a beautiful day, guys. And the lake is right there. <laughs> but it's okay, guys. All right. I'm here to hike the trail, not to jump in the lake. But if that's what you guys want to do, you know, leave it in the comments. Maybe one day I will go jump in the lake. Anyways, and I'll just pan off for you can see, so you can see. And it goes on, guys. It goes on. Like I said, we're on the other side of the mountain. And so we're wrapping around. So this is making, it's making a loop right now. So if I played my cards right, and I read those signs right back there, when we get done with this trail, we should be back at the Jeep. Should be, but if not, I've got a lot of walking to do back. It's no problem, guys. No problem at all. I did bring flashlights. <sighs> yup. It's beautiful, guys. It's beautiful. I'm sorry, I want to deviate again, and we're going to go closer to the water just once more. I'm not jumping in, I promise. All right, let's see what I see. Oh, 
Oh my goodness, guys. Nice. All right, I'm going to put my stick down so I can hold my camera steady so I don't drop it in the water. Okay, guys? Here you go. All right, so this is basically a part of the lake, but you know, like I said, it wraps all the way around this uh, area, and you know, it's a nice trail, very scenic, and you know, it's a good place to take your families. I mean, very nice. <clears throat> but we came here to hike, guys, so we're gonna continue on the hike. But I just thought you guys want to see this. It, it, you know, just the part of it where it's opened up. You know, it's, it's beautiful, guys. It really is. All right, let's get back on the trail. Just one more. Okay. I got to get back on the trail, guys. Okay. And like I said, I hope I, my top camera is covering all this. I don't know, but uh, we shall see in the end. Okay, back on track, or trail, yeah. Okay, I guess with the, the top camera, you see some behind the scenes too, because I didn't stop the camera, only just to change the battery on the top one. If I include it, I don't know. I don't know if it's good footage or not. I'm gonna try. To get the most I can because it's better to have a lot of footage than not enough okay we hit another trail marker guys there you go and that well right there milestone and I don't know if you can see over here where my stick is at there's a tiny butterfly I don't know you see him he's right there you see at the end of my stick I don't know if you can see him. Right there. You see him? I try. I don't know if you saw him or not. But anyways, check me all out, guys. And I'm going to step aside, okay? You know why. I'm just pan out to the outside there. And that way, no one gets in the shot. <laughs> Everything's great, guys. All right, like I said, this is video number four, and uh, we're just continuing on, all right? And hopefully, I got everything. And the squirrels are rampant, look at that. Oh my goodness. But I haven't seen any bears or snakes, so that's a good thing. Very good thing. There's no more activity out here, though. A lot of butterflies, too. We like butterflies, guys. Yeah. Eventually, one day, I believe, uh, I might go to, like, uh, the aquarium, like, in Tennessee or something. Because they've got a room out there. It's got a bunch of butterflies or, you know, it's a controlled climate place. I've been there before. And they have a bunch of butterflies in there, and that would be cool. I don't know if they'd let me film in there, but... Anyways, I think it would be cool. I imagine so. Like I said, there's a lot of people out today. And I'll show you the canopy, guys. And everything, yeah. Uh, check out that weird tree over there. See that? Isn't that weird? Yeah. Check out the weird trees. But like I say, it helps me. <sighs> yeah, I know. I My top camera's running, so I might have to cut out a couple parts where the people were in it. So 
Oops. But it's okay. They won't get in the shot, I believe. You know, I edit all that out. But yeah, I, I do get everybody on the top camera. But it doesn't get to film. It doesn't get to YouTube. I mean, I take the people out of those videos. Okay, guys? So, or shorten them or whatever. Uh, we've hit another one. There's another marker. So we're on track. Like I said, I made a good decision to follow this trail system, okay? Ah, uh, yeah. All right, guys. I'm going to cut this one, too. And then we're just going to go to another one. So I believe the next one is going to be five, I believe. Unless I lost my count. Um, we'll see. So if you like this video, go to the next one. <laughs> yeah, just go to the next one, okay? I think it's five, but don't quote me on that, all right? All right, keep on hiking, guys.